What's up family, this is Aaron G. Man, today we have some sweet and spicy garlic wings we're gonna eat. We're gonna eat some Bella Signature Cheesecake on the side afterwards. Man, I am ready to eat, I am hungry. And how have you guys week been so far? I mean, it's pretty gloomy now. Not a lot going on, so, and I'm ready to go. Let's get it. Mmm. These wings are great. Mm. Man, my wife found this uh, recipe, but after a while, we kind of added our own little spices and seasoning to it. Flamed it up a little bit. Oh my God, let, let you guys get a, get a good look at that. Hold on, hold on. Bruh. Focus. Oh, you can see it here. Wow, I'm telling you, it's like the perfect blend of sweet, spicy, and you got that little garlic in there. Perfect. I was listening at the news the other day, and we heard that Supreme Court has allowed public funds to be used for private schooling. I think uh, religious schools. And I think it was, I think they said it was a major, major victory. I think, but a lot of people are opposed to it because of uh, blurred lines between um, separation of church and state. Wish I can, wish I can kind of see the plight. Um, I believe that it can be kind of be used as a as a tool by political parties in the long run. You know, kind of like that quid pro quo. But I don't know. To me, as long as the schools were giving the children fair treatment, I mean, like giving those uh, children easier access to their schools would definitely be something that I would kind of mandate if they were using public funds. But our kids are homeschooled, so I don't, I don't, we don't fret too much on that. But I can definitely see how people should actually see the issues or I guess the, the plights of it on both sides. I can really see that. I think another big thing is the removal of uh, statues all over the country. You know, some, a lot of, if not all, with um, really racially negative backgrounds. You see a, a big movement with that going on now. I mean, being African American, I really do. I, I can understand the um, the the um, frustration or the anger with it, rebel plagues and different just different uh, historical figures. But here's where the slippery slope is, and I think a lot of people will agree with me. Some may not, but it's okay. 
you know, when does it end? You know, even even with the cancel culture, when does it end? I mean, I feel like it may get to a point to where you can't say anything or free speech. It will be in jeopardy. Mm. You know, I'm all for free speech. You know? I mean, as long as, long as you're not um, threatening anybody or, or threatening anybody's family or livelihood, you know, um, slandering their name, I'm all for it. You know, I might not like or agree with your opinions and what you, you know, the things that you believe, you know, but that's the great thing about living in this country. And I don't want to be, especially starting this channel, I don't want to be in a position to where, you know, I had to shut down for, oops, I, you know, said something that might have offended somebody. So you have to be real careful now, no matter what, what you're doing or what, what your actual stand is. You have to be really careful on how you approach people, how you talk to people. I mean, it's definitely, the landscape has definitely changed. My wipes, I have to shut off and get my wipes. Dirty. The other thing is, man, what's up with all these races, these crazy racist groups just flooding Facebook now? Or, you know, all the, all the different social media sites. Man, it's like I can't, I can't go, I can't, I can't wake up without hearing somebody just trolling about something. It's, it's nuts. Um, man, but, you know, I do get sucked into it sometimes and I have to battle. I have to battle. So, <sighs> that's crazy. If you're out there, I know you're having fun with it. But please, just 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 leave, leave it, leave it alone. Leave the, leave the racist, the racist groups alone. Our signature cheese cake. Look at that. Look at that baby right there. Let's see if I can. Like you never had Bella's cheesecake. I'm telling you. Watch. Look at this. That's amazing. And I'm not just bragging because it's my cheesecake. I'm telling you, it's off the chain. Man, it's so good. I think other news is that Corona coronavirus is on the rise again in the U.S. Um, hundreds of thousand cases. I don't have the actual numbers up right now, but if you're out there and you don't believe it's real, that's okay. Just be safe. Take care. You can do your part to uh, protect uh, the people around you. Oh man, I believe I believe I read somewhere whether the EU. European Union took us off the travel list, so you know it's real. We getting blacklisted. America getting blacklisted? Yeah, it's real. I think a lot of it had to do with The big vacations, the big things that kind of happened right after the um, the May lockdowns or the May um, quarantines. Uh, everybody was just so excited to get back out and just like, man, we, you know, it's over. But you know, it's, it, it really wasn't over. So just protect yourself. Man, this cheesecake is fire. And the experts saying that look, it, everybody might seem like they're okay, everything might be going okay, but numbers, the, the, the rise and the numbers 
aren't going down they're going up so we have to be careful we have to take control and the only thing we can really control we can't control mother nature but we control ourselves so don't, don't go out there trying to live your best life and and, and do and do your hot girl uh, summer thing because um look i don't want to get sick i'm sure a lot of you guys don't want to get sick so be smart about what you're doing don't go, go out there and put yourself in positions where you're gonna get sick so i know nobody wants to stay at home i'm sick and tired of staying home it's, it's still the stuff you want to do but until this stuff gets under control or until at least we have some kind of um medication or vaccine to take care of you if you get it just try not put yourself in a position the way you're not going to get it man i almost hate to see it go away you know when you we eat something so good to where a little tear comes out when you get your last bite. Are you trying to you trying to hold it? You trying to hold the tear back? That's where I'm at right now. What's that good? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I'm telling you. One of the best cheesecakes in the world. Oh man, that food's so good. Oh man, it is. I thank you. I appreciate you coming through. I appreciate you stopping by and coming to my channel. If you haven't liked or subscribed to my channel, please do both. We're gonna have more videos coming to you soon. I promise you guys have a wonderful week and stay tuned.